Hey, good morning. Before we start the day, and I, I have something exciting I want to share, share with you, I need to get some coffee, as you can probably tell. So just give me just a second. I don't know why. I don't know why that's sitting on the coffee machine, but it looks kind of creepy. But I got my coffee, and now we're about ready to talk about what's over my shoulder, and I'm pretty excited about it. So I want to start off by saying that there's no affiliate program. I'm not sponsored. I made this choice for a couple of reasons. One, it was in stock, because if you're in the RV market, trailer RV market, they are tough to find in stock. And I got super lucky to be in the right place at the right time and bought this new trailer from Jayco, J-Flight. It's the Baja edition, 19 and a half foot trailer. And I'm super, super excited to start adding this to the fishing scene, right? So this is going to be joining me on a lot of my fishing adventures moving forward. And I had done some tent camping in the past, but you know, to be honest, when you're out there, especially you're fishing the fall and winter months, it's just not as fun to do it in a tent. And now I'm gonna have this wonderfully cozy trailer towed behind the Jeep to join me in a lot of my fishing adventures. So I just wanted to introduce to you the new trailer. And I'm looking for you to help me with some naming ideas. I gotta put a name on her, right? So leave some suggestions down in the comment of what you think I should name our new trailer. So let's take a look. So first and foremost, I was a little worried that the Jeep wasn't gonna be able to tow this thing because this thing is pretty darn heavy and right about at the maximum that the Jeep can tow. But the guys down in Camping World put a, put a tow package on this thing. It's called a weight distribution kit and it really does seem to work because the Jeep doesn't squat down any more than a couple of inches on something that has several hundred pounds of tongue weight. So I'm happy with how it's towing. And this thing really is equipped nicely. One of the things that I needed, I needed a bed that was north-south, right? Because I'm super tall. I can almost stand up straight and anything east-west wouldn't work because I would have nowhere to stretch my legs. So this having a north-south bed was one of the more important things that I was looking for. It's got a seven pound tank, a couple of batteries. It's got a cool solar panel so I can be completely off the grid when I'm out there camping. So you can do the hookup thing, but if I'm out there on the St. Joe or out in the middle of nowhere, I now have a fully functioning trailer with most of the basics with this solar kit. So I'm super excited about taking it off road. It does have a really big refrigerator, uh, a dinette table that folds into a bed and a stereo system with speakers inside and out. The Baja edition, what that does, it gives you a really good tire, right? It's an, it's an all season Goodyear tire. The trailer is actually raised up several inches so it can clear any of the type of dirt roads or skitter roads that you might take the trailer down. And it just has a little mud flap there as well. So it's just built more for the off-road versus on-road. So I like that feature as well. I should also mention that it has an awning, which I'm super excited about. When you go inside, it's got a full bathroom, both with a toilet and a sink, nice closet, great storage space considering how small the trailer is. It's got a little two burner stove. It has a microwave. It has, uh, what else does this thing have? Oh, all, all LED lighting. It's got the USB port so I can charge my phone or charge any batteries, which is pretty important when you do the type of filming that I do. Um, it's got heavy duty stairs and I think that comes with the Baja package. I love these stairs. I mean, they are stout. Couple of leveling jacks. Did I miss anything? It has an air conditioner and a propane furnace. The refrigerator and freezer can run on AC and propane. It's, it's pretty well equipped. And I'm super excited to start featuring this trailer on a lot of my fishing adventures. So I just wanted to take a moment this morning and introduce you to the new trailer. Once again, I'm taking name suggestions, so need your help. All right, everybody. Till the next time, thanks for your help and fish on.